If there was one single thing that somebody could do to improve management and performance in their cow-calf herd, it would be body condition scoring. Body condition scoring is the hands-on method of measuring the amount of fat cover that a cow is carrying, which is a, a direct reflection of her health and of her production state. It is really important to a cow-calf producer because it is one of the only tools he has to be able to assess the health of his animals and to be able to know whether he needs to adjust his management or his nutrition. It's a simple tool, it's easy to learn, and it's very inexpensive. If a cow is in proper body condition, she is going to be putting enough nutrients into the calf so that it's growing properly, and she'll be passing proper levels of immunity onto her calf when that calf is born. We have a calving season that's approximately three 21-day cycles. In the ideal situation, we like to have cows cycling early, breeding early, so that when the calving season comes around, we have the majority of those calves born in that first 21-day cycle. The calves that are born earlier on have more days to put weight on, which could equate to you know anywhere from $80 to $100 more per calf at the end of the season. We measure body condition score on a scale of one to five. So one is extremely thin and five is very fat. And so ideally we like to have our cows for optimum production and reproductive health to be somewhere in the middle from a 2.5 to a three. When you look at a cow, the fat cover can be very deceiving to try and assess visually. And so you really need to get in there, get your hands on her, and feel her in some very specific key areas of her body to determine how much fat she's actually carrying and how healthy she is. The first place that you want to be taking a look at and feeling are the short ribs. The last few ribs, uh, right after the long ribs, between the hip bone and the long ribs along her spine. So you want to go in there and feel with your hand and put some pressure on there with your thumb. You should be able to feel those short ribs with some pressure, but you shouldn't be able to count them individually. They shouldn't feel sharp. You should feel some padding in that area, and that padding is going to be fat. The other areas that you want to also check are the spine and the top of the spine. You also want to check out the hook and the pin bones, which are the two points of the pelvis. And also on either side of the tail head, you want to look to see and feel if there's any cushy fat cover in that area as well. It's not really important to be able to get an exact number. You just want to be able to know whether she is under conditioned at a right condition or if she's over conditioned. You know, if you can divide them up into at least those three categories, you're probably away to the races in terms of knowing what you're doing and, and determining if you need to change your management. Body condition scoring really just takes a few minutes. If you think about the value of the information that you could receive from taking that few extra minutes to assess the body condition on your cows, it is time well spent and could really save a producer thousands of dollars in the long run in making sure that they're getting things on track in terms of keeping the cows healthy and keeping the reproductive health in check.